Hello everybody, Miss Olivia here. Today we're going to learn another interesting word from our book, Crunch the Crocodile. So, the interesting word we're going to learn is the word monstrous. Can you say it with me? Monstrous. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to read a sentence from our book. And when you hear the word monstrous, I want you to put up your hand. Okay? You're listening for the word monstrous. What a big, gigantic, monstrous meal Crunch would have. All he had to do was open his mouth and let them come in. Did you hear it? The word monstrous. Now, the word monstrous means something that is really, really big. Okay? So we're going to make an action so that we can remember that word monstrous. So we're going to stretch our arms out really wide and say monstrous. Because monstrous means something that is really, really big. Monstrous. Now, an example of something that might be monstrous would be from our book. If Crunch the Crocodile ate all of the animals in this story, it would be a monstrous meal. It would be a very, very big meal. Or if the whole oval was covered in mud, it would be a monstrous amount of mud. We could also say the Eiffel Tower is monstrous because it is so tall. What's that tricky and interesting word we've learned? Monstrous. Everyone say it monstrous. Now I'm going to say some sentences now and if you think that sentence means something is monstrous I want you to say monstrous and put out your arms really really wide like this. If you don't think it's monstrous I want you to just stay quiet and put your hands in your laps. Okay let's have a go. A pizza the size of our classroom that would be monstrous. What about a pencil? No that's not monstrous. What about enough popcorn to feed the whole school? That would be monstrous. What about 20 sandwiches in your lunchbox? That would be a monstrous amount of lunch. Monstrous amount of lunch. What about a dog that's taller than you? It would be a monstrous dog. So now what I want you to do is I want you to practice using the word monstrous in a sentence. I'm going to show you a sentence that we're going to use. Okay. So, I saw a monstrous something when something. So if I do an example for myself, I could say, I saw a monstrous rain cloud when it was about to storm. Now I want you to have a go using the word monstrous in a sentence. Remember monstrous means something that's really, really big or large. Okay, so we have learned a new tricky word today, and that is the word monstrous. Everyone say it with me. Monstrous. And remember, monstrous means something that is really, really big or large.